th that episode was about how animals make decisions. And it talked about a troop of baboons. And a troop of baboons, kind of like a pride of lions. There's a bunch of them live together, and there's like an alpha male, alpha female. And what they studied about this troop of baboons was when they decide to go somewhere, they wake up in the morning, and there's all these different baboons. And what happens is like two of them go off to the left, and then two or three of them go off to the right, and then they end up circling back to the bigger group. And more and more little groups of baboons tend to start branching off in different directions and coming back to the bigger group. But certain groups will kind of have more participants, and those groups will kind of grow. And it doesn't matter the rank of the members in this group. It just matters like what direction starts to attract more baboons. And that ends up being the direction that the whole troop goes. And I'll tell you that that to me is about as close as it gets to how order flow works. And if that makes any sense, like that's the way order flow works between buyers and sellers and prices being checked and when that price is checked does it does it get more attention or does it get less and prices that get more attention tend to get more business and prices that get less attention tend to get less business um so when you see a price getting checked what's actually happening is is there's like two baboons that are running towards the bottom and then they're immediately running back because nobody else is going with them Whereas when you see a breakout happen, it means there's a lot of baboons that are running towards a price, and then all the rest of the baboons have to go with them. So I hope that's not too out there, but I think that that's a very it's it's really kind of I think that's a really good example 